Who won something? I don't know. 2024? That's good. That's cool. All right, let's turn to the world of Fortnite. If you haven't already, check out the Game Awards Island in Fortnite. It's been updated with new trophies tonight to collect. Blue baby to Fortnite blue baby. Expanding into a full-on platform with tons of new experiences beyond Battle Royale. Earlier today, Lego Fortnite launched. And on Saturday, Jurassic Park the game, game Fortnite meh. Festival. Tomorrow, though, the team at Psyonix behind Blue baby Rocket to blue baby. League let's go. Rocket Racing. Here's your first look. I don't give a fuck about racing games. Not a fan. Got. I did play Beautiful Katamari. That was a fun game. I suck at it, though. Rocket League Racing. Right there. Like we're getting obsessed with samurai and ninjas and stuff. Game science. Master, are there more good folks in the world or bad? More good. I'm here for it though. Of course. Then why is there always suffering? And why yeah, it's ramping up kind of like how zombies did. Because goodness without teeth punishes. This reminds me of uh. It foments evil. Oh, the world with Wukong? And grow lotuses in it. That is your destiny. This reminds me of Demon Slayer. I, the keeper of the new west, welcome the destined one. The destined one who doesn't even know what he's destined for. Those old rascals, they surely know how to name. This game looks cool. Is it a Souls like? So this is the place of the destined one. It will fit me just as well. Bathe in blood yet reaching peace. Oh you mortals. Please don't be a souls like what justifies your superiority. Wukong! Okay, that doesn't look looks more like Devil May Cry like. Like Bayonetta style. Got a war. A thousand percent souls like? You think so? You're definitely Wukong. With his staff. Black Myth Wukong. That game looks cool, though. Batman. Green Lantern. Superman. Your friends are slaughtering the people they swore to protect. Oh. Oh hell no. My justice league will burn this earth down. They're all corrupted. And the villains have to save the world. We have to kill this Diana. We have to kill this Diana. 
have to die to save the world. We can work with that. You think you're a team now? You think you can stop us? Thought you'd never ask. Pick and choose, sit and lose, all you different crews. Chicks and dudes, so you think it's really kick and chill. He's the fastest oh, man we... According to all the Looks like we're about to do a raid. I thought I had 50, 40 minutes left. I think they want to pull at 9, though. Raiding party. I can log on and get an invite. I'm, I can be in, outside the zone. I don't know if they're doing DMT though. Up in Canada to talk about all things Warframe. Uh, we've got a special Warframe Twitch drop. Tonight. I've met her before. But I understand you've also got some other news for Warframe. Yeah, we do. You know, it's been 10 years for Warframe, so you know, 10 years for you. We assume you'd get a senior discount of some kind, just because our game's probably the oldest game here, maybe. But yeah, we Keep have... going strong. I know, it's because our community is so awesome, and we are going to be showing you the release date for our next major update for Warframe. So we do have a trailer for, you know, Warframe players around the world to watch, which is quite exciting. Yeah, I mean, it's been an incredible ride, 10 years of just our incredible developers, our community just supporting us along the way. So if you're a Warframe fan and watching, we love you and thank you so much. And I hope you enjoy the next update, Whispers in the Walls. Oh yeah, thanks for having us back too. Devs at home, we love you guys. All right, thanks guys, let's take a look. For generations you've slept. No purpose, no call to wake you. But now, I know nothing about Warframe. Have changed everything. The lidless eye has seen you, the Tano. Any of y'all play Warframe? A great game. I heard it's hard. It has a high learning curve. Is that the boss in AQ20? It is waiting. Don't be More Game Awards ahead. You thought the surprises were done? Nope, there's lots coming, but while you're here, head to SuperGameAwards.com through December 31st for a chance to win a trip for four to the brand new Super Nintendo World at you Universal take Studios. Take straight Hall. up damage. Message me for invite to raid. Hmm. Ready for a new way to go? Experience the immersive world of Super Mario. Brought to life like never before. Universal Studios Hollywood. I wanna go. Chat, let's go to Super Mario World in Universal's Florida. You're close to there. I think it's Florida. The Starfield. 
a cinematic masterwork. I was not very impressed with Starfield. No Man's Sky is just better. That's what I was thinking. Life I have no keys. Death to the dead. We have sworn to protect the living from the lingering death. How can the incarnate and the invisible separate to bring peace for every soul? Once their grip of this world is broken. Come on, keys. Life to the living. Death to the dead. Life to the living. Death, Death to the dead. Life to the living. Death to the dead. Honoring my oath. Or sacrificing the living to bring me back. I'm not sure I can do this. Honor your oath. Or bring me back. But don't leave me like this. What is this new world? I have no idea. I can't tell. New game, old game, Banishers, Ghosts of Eden. No clue. Is being recorded. What is your emergency? I would never want to get a collector edition for a game that I'd never heard of, like a brand new game. I feel like collector's editions are for like you ready? games you're nostalgic for. Down. Down. Found a key. We got it Look out! Ready? If I ever played Bioshock, yeah, Bioshock's amazing. The first one was so good. Just transports you to a whole nother world. So, are you ready? are just some of the big titles coming to mobile in 2024. Head to the Game Awards on Twitch to vote for which title you want to win Google Play's own Play More Award. Now, please welcome last year's winner of Games for Impact for the game As Dusk Falls, which is coming to PlayStation on March 7th and is available for pre-order tonight. Creative Director that was not worth it. Marshall. Do you wonder if they get to pick their own music? Bonsoir, everyone. Ba -da -da -ba -da 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 -da. Maybe pick from a list of music. Of my 22 years in the industry. Games for Impact is one of the most important categories at the Game Awards. The games nominated this year offer unique yes. and nuanced perspectives on topics that concern us all, from the climate crisis to cultural diversity. They broaden our horizons, foster empathy, and connect us as Let humans. Me, uh... In a world torn apart by divisions and intolerance, this is one of the most essential powers of our medium. Here are the outstanding nominees. Go log in real quick. Games for impact. Legend says a traveler will reunite the peoples. What's the theme? Using this year to um, make an impact. How are you? And the game of world goes See to... you later. Chia! What was it for? 
don't even know what that was for. Stia? I accept this award on behalf of uh, Games for Impact. Oh, okay. You cannot be here, but I got a message from Phil Crippo, co founder of Ourself. I'd like to thank Ourself family for your trust and unbelievable talent. Kepler and Sony for believing in this crazy project. And the entire population of New Caledonia who championed and embraced cheer all along. Thank you, Mercy. Oleti. I don't I don't know what he's saying, but I appreciate him. Very much. Gotta figure out what game he's repping. Hello! I'm Abu Bakr Salim. I'm mainly known for my acting work in Raised by Wolves and okay. Assassin's Creed Origins. Okay, he didn't sound happy about Assassin's but, Creed but, Origins. But that is not why I'm here. Okay. Sorry, no, this is, this is crazy, man. <laughs> I mean, I, I remember watching the Game Awards when I was younger, so being up here now is like... <laughs> okay, I like him. Look, I've, I've loved games all my life. Uh, I, I mean, I've played them all my life, man, from Kingdom Hearts, Gary's Mod, Golden Sun. Oh, little Golden Sun. And it, it, it started with my dad, right? He got me into them. He understood, you know, that games are an art form. You know, it's a great space to enjoy and escape from the reality of the world. He passed away a while back, and I'll tell you what, I'm still figuring it out. But four years ago, I decided that I needed to try and process my grief in a way that felt true to me and him. So I took the biggest risks of my life and threw everything that I had in making a game. Oh, he's making a game. Art that honored him, an ode to the people we have loved and lost. Terrible items. So. Oh, he's losing it. He's gonna make me. He's gonna make me cry. So the reason I'm here tonight is because with the love and support of a lot of people here, I'm going to take another big risk and I'm going to show you what we've been building. Now I'm going to offer you this game, a game from my old man. I hope you like it. Every story begins at the end of another. Each story carries with it the echoes of those that came before. Support from Critical Role? My Baba, my father. Your story was snatched away too soon. My name is Zhao, shaman of Genzera. Here, I seek my father's return. Oh, it's like an Ori game. My God, I did not. I need. I need my glasses, man. This run is going poorly. I, cannot stop. I didn't get hit for the first three floors either. Kalunga, God of Death, hear my plea. Kalunga, God of Death, come to me. Show me you are ready. Our hero! <laughs> Life is strange, director.
blocked myself in with poop. Nice. I'm popping the huge growth. Fuck it. That was Lost Records, a brand new world from the film to behind Life is Strange. Now we have a world premiere new look at a game based on an ongoing franchise of 18 years ago. Range up. 50 million users worldwide. This entirely Purgatory. engine trailer shows off the blend between cartoon 3D graphics with hardcore action. This is the first Berserker. First Berserker. Finally, I found you. Trampled by the one who trusted. Abandoned from your king. He thought you were a hero. Looks cool. That looks like a soul's like for sure. It's got like a almost like an anime art style to it. Looks good, right? All right, now it's time for our first performance good, by the man. Game Awards Orchestra. This one, though, is a little bit of a twist. They're about to play music from an upcoming game that no one has heard yet. You might call it one of those world premieres, and this is a special one. You it's might. written by one of the greatest video game composers of all time, one of those world legendary premieres. Nobuo Utamatsu. Here is the Game Awards Orchestra led by Lauren Balf with lead vocals from Lauren Allred debuting the theme song from Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Oh, let's go. with the no item. <laughs> oh, 
I would rather have this than the poop. Easy mom kills. What an absolutely beautiful song from Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, which is nominated for most anticipated game tonight. Thank you to Lauren Allred and Maestro yeah, Lauren sing some of it for us, bud. Was he really even listening? Later to pay tribute to our game Does this guy even play games? Who but is this that's guy? That's not all we have tonight for Final Fantasy. I have done that set in stone. Or so they'll tell you, Deity. Because the future has Final the Fantasy? power to change anything. Even the past. Strap in, Muty. Things the are about hell? to get mighty interesting. What is happening? This does not look good to me so far. Apex Final Fantasy. Okay. Weird. That's a very fun when limits are made to be broken when Final Fantasy VII Rebirth comes to Apex Legends on January They're 9th. trying to pull a the Fortnite. You just saw was drawn by Morrison himself. Thank you so much for that incredible announcement. Now it's time to announce Everybody's just like, what? More awards as selected by the fans In the category of best score and music, the nominees are Alan Wake 2, Baldur's Gate 3, Final Fantasy 16, Hi-Fi Rush, and The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. And the game award goes to Final Fantasy 16. Really? So congratulations. Here are the nominees for best independent game. The Goon, Days of Diver, Dredge, Sea of Stars. Come on, Sea of Stars. Fire. There's no way it wins. Goes to David Diver. Sea of Stars. What? Let's Congrats go! Sabotage. Here are the nominees for best community support. Baldur's Gate 3. Let's Super go! Destiny 2, Final Fantasy 14, and No Man's Sky. And the game award goes to Baldur's Gate 3. Of course, it Congrats should win every category it ever is mentioned in. Nominees for best fighting game. Those are God of Rock, Mortal Kombat 1, Nickelodeon All-Star Brawl 2, Pocket Bravery, and Street Fighter 6. Gotta be Street Fighter 6. And the game award this year goes to Street Fighter 6. Yeah. Capcom. All right. Most anticipated game. Your nominees this year were Final Fantasy 7 Bookworm Rebirth, for one heart. Hades 2, Like a Dragon, <laughs> Infinite Wealth, Star Wars Outlaws, and Tekken 8. And the game award this year goes to Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth. Oh, it Congratulations, wasn't. Congratulations, Square and Nomura All right. Well, it's been eight months I'm since the release my of Honkai Star Rail, that a sucks. winner tonight for best mobile game. This space fantasy RPG filled with myths and legends is set for more intergalactic expeditions in 2024. And tonight, we have an exclusive look at Penacone, the next destination. Do you still remember fables about the stars? Its stories tell of what is and what was. Its pages will always reveal something. So lucky I got a curve horn. What is this? A Tails game? Honkai Star Rail? What is this? Genshin. Those are unforgettable memories, but they are only the beginning. Now, I heard people only play this for the waifus. Suffering and joy will both be added to the final draft of the story. That's GTA 6. I would only play for the waifus. The path of the trailblaze will continue. Perhaps on one of these pages. I'll appear in your story, too. Welcome to Penacone! The 
young lady. May I ask your name? Acheron. Galaxy Ranger. Is that like a shocker? Hey, tonight for best mobile game. Monster Hunter Now is the new mobile game from Niantic and Capcom. Like all Niantic's games, Monster Hunter Now is played in the real world, and tonight they have a special in-game event going on right now with new monsters, new weapons, and special free items for new players to join the hunt. Bob it's and Weave, baby. Bob and Weave. iPhone and Android. So Save check it the out. HP. Monster Hunter Now. Coming up, we've got an exclusive new look at the new Fallout series. Right back. Oh, shit. He killed it. He killed it himself. Idiot. That guy sucks. Definitely don't want to do this floor again. Good Isaac fighting music. I don't know what we're watching. Pirates. Woo! One piece again? They just keep hitting us with that one piece. Top right. And that was a new look at Skull and Bones from Ubisoft, which is coming out on February 16th. I'm happy to announce the players can register now for the upcoming closed beta on December 15th on all platforms. And now it's time for the announcement of the next game from the studio that won Best Game Direction in 2021. Elden Ring this year? Anonymous just gifted two subs. Let's go. Lock up tight now. Thank you. Shit. Now you just get I'm gonna hit myself. Put that knife in there. The booty knife. Booty knife. Victory! 
Jacob Bacaba from Arcade yes. Round and Bill Roseman from Marvel to tell us how did this come together, guys? Well, Jeff, let me tell you, the secret superpower of nice, Marvel dude. games is our constant focus is that on five? bringing together world-class talent That's with the five favorite characters that they love. We're five now, deep we already. we are huge fans of Arcade and Leon. Good run. Not only because of the story-rich games that